Welcome to this video. Um, I'm going to show you how to set up OpenGL and C++ development environment with GLUT under code blocks. So we're going to use free GLUT instead of GLUT because GLUT is depreciated and may not work with the newer version of your compiler. And so let's get started. Um, so we first go to freeglut.sourceforge.net and on the web page on the left hand side you will find a download link. You click this and now you scroll further down you'll find some stable releases but these releases are uh, not binaries um, if you use binaries it will be easier so you go further down to the prepackaged results there you'll find uh, the version for MinGW and you click on that link and the, mm, you scroll down on this web page to the MinGW package and if you look here down um, you can find that it supports code block this is what we need and you click this and your download will start immediately and after you have downloaded the file we need to extract its contents so you can extract it in the same directory so now you go into the free glut folder after extracting and you go straight into the binaries folder on the top and if you're using 32-bit system you copy this freeglut.dll or like me if you're using 64-bit system you go into the 64-bit folder and then copy the freeglut.dll from there now you navigate to your C drive and scroll further down to find Windows folder and in this directory you paste your DLL and um, you might need administrator permissions for that so you have to provide these so after you're done copying free glut and uh, now we, sh uh, we will proceed uh, in for setting up the compiler so you go back to the free glut directory go um, and there you copy the include and lib folders copy both of these together and now you need to navigate to your compilers installation directory um, mine is inside um, the code blocks installation directory same place so now you go into the mingw64 your compilers directory there you will find a folder named include inside this folder uh, you search for a folder named gl if it uh, if it exists then you're going to use this directory uh, use the previous directory from here um, if it does not exist like in this case there should be another folder um, min gw32 note that if that uh, folder exists uh, don't follow the next step so if the folder does not exist you go into the min gw32 folder and then you'll find another include folder and your gl folder should be here now and if it is here you go to the previous directory and you now paste the both of your folders here and it will ask you to merge the contents of these folders because they already exist and you should click yes and you should do it for all these items so after you have done all this um, you now need to set up some code block templates so you now go into your code blocks installation directory go into the share folder it should be on the top and then go into the code blocks then scroll down and navigate into the templates folder and in this folder you now navigate to the wizard folder Here you'll scroll down and find a folder named glut. You need to open this. So
So here in this directory, you will find a file named wizard.script. Uh, you need to edit this, so use a suitable text editor like Notepad. Now you need to find some stuff. So you can manually do this or you can use a tool. So you find and you need to find glut32 inside it. So search for it and replace this by free glut. And you need to do this again because there are two places in which you need to edit this. So you change it again, replace it with free glut. Now you save your file. And after you have done this, the next thing you'll need to do is setting um, up the code blocks template project file for glut. So for this, you go back to the templates directory and scroll down and you will find glut.cbp file. You now need to edit this one. So you can use notepad and you do the similar stuff in this file. You go to find and search for glut32. So free glut won't exist in this file because this is by default, this uses glut and you find glut32 and then you replace this with free glut like we did in the previous file and similarly you save this and after you've done any, uh, everything of this right uh, you're now ready to go and create a new project in code blocks so create a new glut project you will find this down here glut project and type a suitable project title and it'll ask you to give the location of your glut so the location will be uh, the installation directory of your compiler because we install the glut inside our compiler and click next and then finish so now you're now set with a glut project and you can view the source code template source and now you can build and run your template source code so if you've done anything everything right so this will work so guys this was all and if this video was helpful um you can support me by subscribing to my channel honestly that is going to help a lot and so i'm going to wrap it up here thanks for watching Stay tuned.